Welcome to Savage Sports Cards, everyone. Today we're opening up a bo hobby box of 2022 Series 1. Uh, this is my first video with audio if you listen to my other videos. So uh, if there's any problems with it, please hang in there with me. I'm going to get them worked out for next time. But So this product just came out. The release date was 2 uh, This I got ordered this pre-order from Steel City Collectibles. Um, I think it sold on the Topps website for $79.99, but I believe it's sold out now. So uh we'll open up i got some mail to open up first and then we'll get right to it this is a card i've been looking at for a little while now to add to my pc for my base uh 2018 It's a Glaber Torres Update Series 200 uh, PSA 10. So that'll go into the PC. Put that up. All right, so for 2022 Series 1, seen a lot of different opinions on social media about it. Some, obviously some positive, some negative. Um, it seems that the print run is very high which is kind of to be expected with the supply and demand lately with the, the sports card industry. And as most people know by now, this is all about chasing wanders. So hopefully we can get a few of them, a couple of them. Now the Wander thing, there's also been an interesting debate between what his true rookie card is. I myself would be, cons I would consider this the more valuable uh, rookie card, even though it seems like the print ones are probably be a lot higher, probably be a higher pop count on PSA. But I just don't see Bowman as a true, without, I just don't see it as the true rookie card product. So. I'd like to hear you guys' thoughts in the comments, what you think, what you consider to be a true rookie card, what you think will be the more valuable. So the big thing I think we're looking for out of here is obviously the Wanders, but any parallels of the Wanders. Uh, we'll start with the Silver Pack. Jerry Kellant, Marcus Simeon, Edward Cabrera, rookie, Josiah Gray, rookie. There are a couple other rookies in this product that might end up being all right. Jaron Duran is not one of them. But obviously, like I said, it's all about Wander Franco. So I'll show you the odds here on the back if you want to pause it and look. Looking for a gold is golds are one in thirty-eight, so that's quite a bit higher than last year. So first off, I do like the design of them this year. I, I think they're a lot cleaner, a lot. I, I, I like the name. A lot of people I've seen like the name is a lot bigger this year, easier to read. But I just think overall, they didn't do too much on them. The borders look nice. It's just a nice, clean card. So, Michael Brantley. Mookie Betts. Tommy Dahlbeck, Future. Clanan, Willie Mays, welcome to the show. That's another thing about this year's product I do like is that some of the inserts I've seen, I do like a lot of the inserts, in particular like the flashiest feet one. I think those are going to be a cool product. Home run leaders. There are a lot of 
horizontal cars I've seen early on. Jake Berger, rookie. Fernando Tatis. And here's our relic. David Ortiz, Major League Material. As game used. And we got Harrison Bader, Jesus Lazardo, Ryan McMahon, Mahan, and Old Donald. Mason Thompson, rookie. Hoy Park, rookie. Price Harper. Robin Yelp, throwback insert. I like that 87 design though. I believe they just did a throwback of it. I believe it was in 2017, which I found kind of soon to be doing again, but I always like that design. Xander Bogarts, Zach Thompson rookie. Backwards card here. And it's a blue Dontro Willis. 87 throwback. It's a nice looking card. D train. The thing about this product, I think, is it's definitely something you're going to want to get early on because just because there's so much of it printed, you're, you're going to want to pull these wanders now because they're going crazy on eBay. And if you're going to want to sell them, you're going to want to sell them now because I think in a few weeks, once people have opened more of this product, you're going to see the prices will eventually start to drop. Kershaw, Rios. Austin Hedges. Here's another insert I really like, a die cut. What do they call this? Can't remember what that one's called. Mike Schmidt though. Kike Hernandez. 
Boba shot. Be interested to hear some of your guys' best pulls of out of this early on. If you have anything you want to put in the comments below, let me know what you pulled. Yachty. Rainbow foil. Atlanta Braves team card. That's a cool card. That's another one. McCormick, Marcus Stroman, Aaron Judge, Zach Short. Well, there's our first one. Wander Franco, Generation Now. A nice rainbow look to these cards as well. I think a lot of these little inserts are going to carry some value too. The Wander ones. They're not just going to be about his base. Where's Guriel? Brandon Marsh, rookie card. This is another rookie. And then people are a little bit high on. Keep running Future Stars. Mubam, Stremski, Shohei, Cardinals, and Astros. Bregman, Vladdy Jr. Jaron Duran, that's another rookie. Greg Maddox, throwback. Seems like every team card so far, I believe, has been horizontal. Rios, Jose Abreu. Jared Kellenick throwback.
on. I think this is gonna be an interesting market to watch too, a secondary market for what sealed wax this is gonna go for. First, just with the the print run, I believe, being so high. It's gonna be interesting to see what it does in the next coming weeks. Also, with the lockout looking like it's gonna be carrying into the start of the season, I wonder if that'll affect the prices of this stuff at all. Joey Gallo. Juan Soto, Pearson, that's another cool card, the home run derby. Meadows. Another welcome to the show insert, a Johnny Bench. Kellenic Future Stars. Obviously with the lockout and a lot of free agents still available, it's early on to tell, but I'd also like to know in the comments what you think. Who's, what are your predictions this year? Who do you think will make it to the World Series? Who's going to win? Ronald Acuna. Can the Braves repeat getting Acuna back? Austin Riley. Another backwards card. It's a gold Jose Iglesias. No wonder, yeah, no wonder base. There's also some pretty sweet short prints I've seen so far this year. In particular, some of the Field of Dreams ones, Tim Anderson, Aaron Judge, and the Corn. Pete Alonso throwback. Wisdom Cup. It's a home run challenge card. It's a good one to have, Bryce Harper. The home run challenge cards look a lot better, I believe, this year, too. They look a lot different than last year. Adam Duvall. Max Scherzer.
Rosarina cup. This is a 6-4 stars shortstop second base combos insert. Lester, Lydell Bruhan, another good rookie. Rays usually draft pretty well. David Price, Andrew Vaughn, Future Stars, Ryan Anderson, Alec Manol, Future Stars. Uh, is our rainbow foil? It is Michael Pineda. Salvador Perez, Schwarber, Dustin Turner, and a cool one, Aaron Judge throwback. Charles Chapman, Kristen Pache, Future Stars, Home Run Leaders. Freeman, Brunetto Door, Jazz Future Stars, Crawford, Logan Gilbert Future Stars. But still no wander base. I'd like to pull at least one. Ryan Zimmerman just retired. And there it is. Pretty well centered. A lot. I've seen a lot of these online. They're off center quite a bit, right to left. I'll have to make room for him. Put him in front of that one. Christian Yelich. Trevor Rogers Cup. Kirilov, Future Stars. Kyle Tucker Throwback. Tyler Stevenson Cup. Nolan Arenado. We got a couple wanders so far, so. Shane Bieber, Kyle Seeger.
Chris Bryant. One interesting thing about the lockout that's going to be fun is after it does end, the frenzy that's going to be happening to sign these free agents that are still available. There wasn't much activity before the lockout, so a lot of teams still a lot of decisions to make. I think a lot of it's going to happen pretty quickly. Giolito, Posey, Kimbrell. And what do we got here? Another insert. Yep, 2021 Greatest Hits. Mike Trout. And Brett Gardner. All right, last pack. <laughs> Chapman, Cattell Martin Hay, Gavin Sheets, Luis Hill, rookie, Garrett Cole, Glass now. So that's it. Look back at a couple of these we got here. Uh, with the print run too, a lot of these golds are gonna be a lot harder to pull this year. So when you get a Wander one, those are gonna be pretty valuable. Jose Iglesias gold, Wander Franco base, looks pretty good. Wander Franco insert generation now. The blue Dontra Willis. And our relic major league material, David Ortiz. All right, so that's gonna be it. If uh, anyone's interested in any of these cards, you can reach out to us on Twitter. I'll uh, let you know what's available, but until next time, that's it.